And meteorologist Laurel Blanchard, those temperatures have, have been really dropping very quickly. Uh, the snow kind of intermittent. So what are we looking at now? Luckily, no more snow. It may look like it's snowing at the moment, but take a look outside. Really, what we're seeing is a lot of snow just blowing around. So luckily, no more snow to add to those totals. But as we take a closer look, here are a couple of viewer photos that were submitted to us and fantastic photos. If you have any photos from this winter storm, we would love to see them. You can send them to PIX at WJHL. As we take a closer look, this is from Geneva Clausen in Butler, Tennessee, showing her thermometer outside and the snow that she got right there. A little bit of a trace, somewhere between a trace and an inch when Butler. And as we also take a look, Eli Bray right here in Hawkins County, showing all that snow blowing around. This is, he was in the passenger seat, he told us, but make sure everyone is driving careful because those roads can definitely be a little bit slick if you're headed out there at all. Take a look at temperatures. We are seeing very, very low temperatures in the city single digits and through the negatives as well. Negatives across southwest Virginia and even in the higher elevations as well. And those wind chills are making it feel like it is 20 below to the human skin. Take a look at this, very, very cold. So if you are going out anywhere but tonight as well as tomorrow morning, please make sure you do bundle up. Everything is going to be frigid, especially with those wind chills. And speaking of wind chills, a couple of winter weather alerts if issued across the area. Currently, there is a wind chill warning issued for the area. This is valid from now until 1 p.m. tomorrow afternoon. So make sure if you are headed out, which I would, would advise you not to do, please just